Imagine for a moment the horrible suffering and tragedy which burns can cause. Victims are subjected to excruciating pain, plastic surgery, and scarring. Patients may be sedated and immobilized for months. They must be fed intravenously, their skin removed and grafted, resulting in transfusions, scars, mutilation, and lifelong psychological trauma. And all of this at enormous cost to the patients and their families. However, like a candle of hope, there is a new treatment which heals burns without pain, surgery, or scars. Sister Antonia Brenner, you orchestrated the introduction of this new medical treatment for burns into Mexico. And every one of us know there's nothing worse than the thought of being burned or a loved one of ours being burned. To see the pain leave their body and see that they're being left without scars is something that's just a miracle. Over 30 years of research and clinical success have proven the value of using the common body substance heparin on the burn and in the body in large doses. Heparin unquestionably stops inflammation, relieves burn pain, enhances healing, and results in smooth, comfortable skin at greatly reduced cost. Dr. Saliba has taught the benefits of heparin burn therapy to doctors in many countries. Dr. Saliba has published and presented this treatment at major burn meetings. Thermal disaster, where if you have more than a few patients who are simultaneously burned, uh, Heparin may be one of the few good options you have. From Jerusalem, Athens, and Rome, to symposia in San Salvador, Las Vegas, and San Diego, We're which he personally sponsored, start. Dr. Saliba has gathered converts to the heparin cause. Prague, Czech Republic. In Prague, we use systemic applications of heparin in the prophylaxis of strombolic. Heparin administered parenterally to you prevent get an accelerated wound healing as well as less of scar no. formation. Systemic heparin, systemic antibiotics, and just cleaning. We didn't do anything. Can you believe it's the same patient? Does anyone want to make any comments about that? Yes. Evidence proves heparin is ideal for most burn cases major disasters, inhalation injuries, children, and where facilities are limited. Dr. Saliba, heparin, heparin. Heparin treatment has now become accepted practice at major burn centers in eight countries. In the beginning, the nurses were stay suspicious, but uh, after the days, uh, uh, the days, uh, these are amazing with the treatment. With reduced suffering, with reduced pain, uh, more comfortable, looking more comfortable. And the nurses and doctors in the hospital, they witnessing that, they are very excited about everything on heparin. Uh, survival rate, it's been uh, up about 40% with some uh, acute uh, burn patients treated at the ICU. And I would say it diminishes the time of hospitalization and it diminishes pain and also the type of skin care it looks much better. Inhalation injury is the biggest cause of morbidity and mortality in the burn patients. Our mortality rate for inhalation injury is about 12 percent. It's probably the lowest in the world. Uh, it seems to work for us. Uh, I think that if people try it, they will find out that it's very effective and they can get their patients off ventilators a lot easier and it helps the patients get well a lot quicker. The possibility that this does reduce pain, that's what brought me to this meeting and I'm, I'm quite intrigued about what I'm hearing here. But, uh, Lincoln said at Gettysburg, I think that uh, hopefully what uh, has been said and has been done in relation to heparin and burns will be remembered. Uh, I think it will be remembered and I think it uh, will be uh, monumental. We've been inter interested in heparin. Uh, for a heparin burn therapy has been scientifically validated 
now it needs universal adoption. Paramedics, doctors, nurses, administrators, the military, insurance providers, the media, and especially the public need to be awakened to the benefits of heparin burn therapy. The nonprofit Saliba Burn Institute will inform the public and train professionals. Without pain and without scars, will revolutionize the treatment of burns through the affordable use of heparin. An awareness and acceptance of it by burn specialists, media, and public will substantially help future burn victims. My sisters who go with the doctor have witnessed this. To see the patient, the pain leave them instantly, instantly. In fact, they say the doctor has the patient, patient singing, singing after a few treatments with him. And isn't that much better than screaming? Now see for yourself how heparin heals from the inside out, sloughing off burn tissue and stimulating the regrowth of healthy, unscarred skin, affordably, without surgery and without pain. before and after painless treatment with heparin. Here are two comparably burned patients. One painfully treated for over three months at a cost of over a million dollars. He has a permanently scarred face and eyes and has lost part of his nose and ears. The other painlessly healed with heparin in only one month, costing less than a hundred thousand dollars is fully recovered with smooth, unscarred skin. Horribly burned hands, wonderfully healed with heparin. And I pray that very soon it will be available to everybody, every place. I hope you'll all participate in whatever way you can that are listening to this.